Hey everyone, welcome, welcome back here to my channel where I play Blend 2. My name is Nisa and today we have a new seal uh, as a mod for Blender 2, this time made by Monsoon. And it is the Rust seal. The Rust seal have one really, really distinctive thing and it is simply that it looks like it have slabbered everything it eats down its throat. It, it does look a little different from seal to seal. I have another picture here you can see where here it's more like lines which I think is the most common variation uh, and here it's more like a mist to be honest. This one is also more brown compared to this variation which is more like black and gray. Uh, so we have a little bit to look after but besides that it is a seal and seals look like seals uh, for the most part so let's just get into the game and yeah as you can see here it is beautiful this is a variation that are very very pigmented but as you can see they chose to go with the more lines um part and the more darker part i haven't seen any different color mouths uh, again i got 10 of them i haven't seen anything else but that color uh, but it is still possible that it is there jumping into zubedia they are endangered and there is 20 to 227 thousand individuals in the wild that was a big span but again ocean animals are a little harder to keep the track on they are from Antarctica and the living aquatic and tundra biomes, which means really, really, really cold. Uh, one of them need 150 square meters of land and 200 of water. And of that, 170 should be deep water. Uh, live in places from minus 15 to 26 degrees Celsius. I don't know a lot of tundra places that do become that um warm but it makes it easier to keep them in a zoo uh, but still make sure they have a cooling area uh great to fence above five feet 94 which is a meter of an 80 or something around there small groups only one male and one female uh group sizes up to four something's wrong here i will say uh dominance is unknown a mating system unknown possibly monogamous so it makes sense only one of each uh neutral around humans and guess should not enter the habitat keep in mind things are unknown is quite common with animals that live places where it's easy uh, difficult to keep track of them again antarctica we don't have a lot of researchers that want to go there it's cold it's expensive and you need to stay there for quite a while. You don't know necessarily when you can get home. So I understand. Uh, and again, ocean animals are difficult. They grow to about seven feet long, which is two meters and 15 or around there. Live for 30 years and weigh 490 pounds, which would be 200 and... 50 kilos roughly and uh, reach sexual maturity at age three and can reproduce until they turn 30 around when they die will give a single offspring every 13 months and be pregnant for 11 months again they do not really live a seasonal place so they don't have like summer offspring winter offspring if every season is the same down there uh repert Reduction in captivity is unknown. Interesting. They have the large ball, the skittles, sprinkler, rubber doggy, and platform. So I assume they're made on the great seal, gray seal, not great, but gray. Um, underwater fish feeder bugs, but only the high, the older variation, and blog of frozen fish, and do not have any interspecies enrichment which i kind of understand because the game don't have a lot of animals from that area of the world so are you gonna turn because then you will be quite easy to get a look at just spend a little bit this way please there we go 
Now, they are darker seals. They are also very much, if you imagine that you are in a ice-filled area, there will be ice on the water here. In general, it makes sense for a lot of animals to be lighter on the belly and darker on the back because when you go down, the top of the water looks like so your camouflage and the bottom of the ocean will of course be much deeper so it will be black but especially when you have eyes on top of the water it makes the bottom even darker because the even less light the eyes take the light and the top even lighter because we have the eyes which is white uh, so it makes a lot of sense for them to have this color we have a lot going on here we have the fur of course most seals have fur. I don't think a lot of people are aware of it. Most animals actually have fur. Uh, even though some of them, even pigs, domesticated pigs, have fur. It's not a lot and it's really rough. Uh, but it's there. Uh, I like the texture. It looks good for the underwater part. We have the small spottings. We have a lot of, like, even we have the dark spots, the light spots, and the even lighter spots here. But they're not like rounded spots, they like all kind of shapes and sizes spots, which I do appreciate. Oh my god, look at the shine. Look at the shine. How did they do that? Oh my god. Okay, if this is something we have on some a lot of things in the game, there's something I have missed. That's beautiful, Monsoon. How, how, what did you do? Can Can we get more fish much or, or underwater much for, for, from monsoon because this is gorgeous even when we get even closer up you can see the shine change even more i want more of this that's beautiful the eyes are gorgeous like again i have a little thing with the whiskers but this is how whiskers look in the game I would like them to be not necessarily thinner, but more like a see-through material. A lot of animals actually have see-through or translucent whis whiskers, not completely see-through, but translucent, uh, which is really, really hard to get in a game that see-through effect. So I do understand them, but God damn it, he did a good job. We have the nice, I assume that's the ear holes. They are placed really, really high, but I don't know the specific seal. So it is possible that that's how it is. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's so good. I love it. It's so good. The only thing that can break this for me now is simply the young. We have the young up here. Oh, it's cute. Oh, it's cute. Here. Oh my god, the light mist mustache. Oh, you're cute. Oh, oh, look at the fur. Look at the fur here. It's gorgeous. I like these whiskers more, though. I do like these more. Again, claws. Fur. Monsoon, you have to make more of these. You have to. It's... Like, look at, not even the fur texture. The fur texture is gorgeous, but we have seen beautiful fur before. But, like, every single little spot, everything in between, every... Oh, my God. Okay, we have this line here. If I should point off something, we have a line going on here. But, honestly, all forgiven here. Like, oh, my God. The only thing I said about is that he chooses to make this magnificent mud with a Antarctic animal that is really hard to build for because you need so much snow, so much cold. Uh, and it's simply, I, 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 maybe some, sometime I can figure out how to make it. I know it's stinky fish, but I'm still just. Oh, it looks like this is actually darker than this, so maybe there is different color mouse. Uh, oh my god. I don't know when or where or how I'm gonna build for them. Someday I'm gonna. Like, some mods come out and I'm just, oh, I'm gonna add them here. I'm gonna build that there. I'm gonna do this clear picture. 
these i feel like you need to do the right thing with them i'm not sure what that is right now maybe they should just have a one-off like a natural habitat not a habitat but like a diorama of antarctica like with cliffs and water maybe a waterfall no plants just snow and all of that that that's pretty much what i feel for right now I, that looks weird <laughs> but i love this oh my god it's so beautiful so so beautiful they still have to shine on land though uh but but really mm, if they're still wet it's not an issue i don't think i have any dry ones uh, the babies do not have that shine to them again they don't stay on land for long in here so yeah that's pretty much what i got to show you today but i hope you are as excited as i am for this beautiful ross seal i feel like i need this in my life it's oh my God. anyway guys i need to i need to focus here ah oh. You're not a drill, guys. Like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notification so you know the next time I upload a video. Really hope to see you again. Either in the comments below or in the next video. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.